Miss Gail with Traders Help to Ask, and I just wanted to go over the ATR support and resistance that we now have available for TradeStation, MultiCharts, and NinjaTrader. Now, this indicator can be used in multiple ways. The easiest way, especially if you're new to trading, is simply to wait for at least two time frames to align in your direction before you take an entry. Then you want a reversal bar. And in this case, you have a reversal bar right here that could have got you into this little small uptrend. You also had another reversal bar here. And these would have been nice for a very quick scalp. Now it comes down, it breaks through, comes down to this blue congestion dot. And once that occurs, you can see that you now have the white and the blue aligned to the downside. You have a reversal bar here, and then you also have a reversal bar here as well. And both of these would have given you an entry into this downtrend. Then it actually comes back up, tests the white congestion dot, and of course, down it comes again. You had two potential entries here. You had one, which is the red bar here, and then the red bar here. That, again, gives you entry into this downtrend. Then you have to wait for the white and the blue to align again, and of course, you get entries into the uptrend, okay? These would have been great for very small scalps. Um, or if you were trading binary options, you could have went in either at the money or out of the money, either one. Now, if you're an experienced trader and you know how I use the ATRs, then you could also take the entries at the blue ATR when the blue dot is above. All that's telling you is that it has found support at the blue ATR. So in this case, you had a reversal bar right here, and of course, up it goes. Again, multiple ways to trade this one indicator, but what it is showing you is actually how the market uses the ATR for support and resistance.